Hey y'all, welcome back to another reaction. Tonight we are going, we are on season two of, I mean, <laughs> episode two. Stay back. Oh my God. Tonight we are going to be watching Stranger Things season four, episode two. Mm -hmm. Do you want to recap what we, how we were feeling or what was going on in episode one? Um, the gang basically split up. Mm -hmm. They're in high school. Yeah, high school, right? In high school? Yeah. Um, they're kind of going through it and they're all, they're all they're going different it. ways, right? Joyce got a doll from Russia. Um, they made a new, they made new friends. Eddie is like their leader kind of. Oh, yeah. Oh, but remember Joyce broke up that, oh, broke up that doll or something about it hops alive. Yeah, I know. That's why I said she got the doll from Russia. I wasn't going to go into detail. Oh, okay. It. Yes, go on. Carry and on. And then. Eddie was introduced. Eddie, Eddie was introduced. So was Christy. They were friends. He's going to give her some drugs, and then she died because that creature thing, Vecna. Then she went through some strange shit. want to give a huge shout out to our patrons. You guys are so awesome. Thank you so much for supporting our channel. You know how much we appreciate you, so thank you from the bottom of our hearts. If you do want to become a patron and help support us and our channel, follow the link in the description. Um, do you want to just hop right into it? I know you were excited to, to get on with episode two, so mm -hmm. yeah. Ready, set, here we go. Enjoy. I just found her there. I, I swear, I, I don't even know her name. I've never seen her before. Just calm down and stay back. God. Hey! You can't be out here. Get back inside. So where'd Eddie go? Look, I need you down here ASAP to tell me what the hell I'm looking at or, or how someone could even do something like this. Ah, they look thrilled. It's like hardcore. Careful, careful. You're squishing, you're squishing your present. It's a rad shirt, man. Ocean Pacific? Oh, hey, Mike, this is uh, my friend Argon. Argon, oh. the same hat. Ish. Hey. Why are him and. <laughs> Oh, Mike no, no, no. So awkward. No, it's a shitty knockoff. <laughs> yeah. But don't sweat it, man. I'll get you the good threads out of here. Why is yeah. Will Payton such a weirdo? Ah. First hangover feels like you're gonna split in two. You'll live. They say who it is? No, not yet. Hey, maybe Chrissy didn't stand you up after all. Hey, don't say that. I guess so, he's a bandit? Well, then he was the guy that got shot in the first one. Also, I said I don't think anyone's gonna care about the game. What's up Nancy's hair? Yeah. Oh, I know. I hate it. She just is like a grandma. Lock tight. Oh, they got another cat. Hi. My heart can't take it anymore. Free. I just can't take it. Freak with Chrissy, the cheerleader? Exactly. Now, his name's not in the news yet or anything, but I guarantee you, Eddie is suspect number one right now. That's crazy. Eddie didn't do this. No way. No way. Same thing that happened there. drives like a maniac and the power goes off in my place all the time it's a piece of shit but this morning i started to think back and i don't know the look on his face he was scared dustin no i can't find lucas or nancy and mike's in california shit 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 dusty where are you going see a friend you heard the news Good point. We'll be extra careful. Thanks, Mama. I love you. Bye. There's no proof of life here. Yes, there is. It's 
signed Enzo. So? So there's only two people who knew about our date at Enzo's, and that's me and Hop. With you, his co-conspirator, making this all an elaborate ruse to capture you as well. You just made all that up. <laughs> <laughs> Bitchin', right? Yeah, yeah, bitchin'. I'm not lying. You're not. You're friends with Angela and Stacy, and you come to parties here? It's gonna be mad. Okay, so I asked for vomit green, and I got vomit green. Oh my god, guys, check it out. <clears throat> Wait, what? What is Eddie? have to do with all this. Did that freak hurt her? No, 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 What are you doing, man? Setting up base of operation. But I know you. I don't think so. Yeah. Actually, I do know you. You're Fred Benson. But you are. Everyone here knows it. Murderer. Okay, what was that? I said act casual. Yeah, it's just... Sorry. Ugh. I don't know. Part of me expected her to be on that plane. Or something. Just like, hey, surprise! <laughs> What's that? It's an acceptance letter to Lenora community. That's where I'm going. I know. But you're going to Emerson with Nancy. No, I'm not. Mm -hmm. Yeah, mine's better. No, it isn't. Milkshakes? Yeah. Come on. She's lying to you, Mike. Bullshit. No, listen to me. She's having problems here. Problems? OK, what kind of problems? Dane, the local snitch. Dummy, no food or drinks on the ring. You really have to no like I think that's hilarious. Mode, please. <laughs> they have a computer in there. Oh my god. <laughs> I received your message, and I would like to make a reservation. Yes. Good, good. But for reservation, you need to make deposit. Uh, wh wh what kind of deposit? $40,000. What? Uh... Sure. Send him to the Devil Colt Hellfire. The cops, they say Chrissy went to him to buy drugs. Drugs? No. That's what I said. Of oh, Colts. It's it's just a DD club. D D D? Dungeons and Dragons? Well, shit, I've read the wrong person plays this game. It can, it can warp their mind. They confuse fantasy and reality, and innocent people die. I mean, it's I been happening all over the country. It's like, it's like an epidemic. Like yeah, no. you're right about that shit. It's real. And I think Eddie, he's the wrong type of person. Oh, yeah. Have you seen or heard from Eddie <laughs> recently? Eddie but when's the last time you talked yeah, to him? Yeah, have you seen him? Seriously? Yeah. Apparently, Eddie gets his drugs from some guy named Reefer Rick, and sometimes Eddie crashes there. That sounds promising. Um, where does this river Rick guy live? See, that's the thing. No one knows. Drug dealer? I guarantee you he's been busted. Someone's at in some the background. <laughs> Means he's in the system. The cops. Really, Steve, that's your suggestion. I mean, I just think at this point they should probably be filled in on what we know. Maybe 
we'd have a little bit more luck if you spent less time trying to find a girlfriend <laughs> and more time Man. trying to find Eddie. Oh, well, somebody has to attend to the customers. Especially if they're babes, right? What are you doing? Maybe we don't need a last name. 12 Ricks already have accounts here. That's a lot of Ricks. So let's narrow it down. <laughs> <laughs> Rick Lipton, Fast Times at Ridgemont High, Chi Ching Chong's next movie. I'm telling you, we've talked to everyone. Nope, not everyone. Hi there. Hi, did you see something last night? What gave me away? Look. You're ugly clothes. Let me just hold you, Mr. Munson. That flag. He killed that girl. I'm not about right. Let me guess. You've been speaking to the Hawkins Post. Let me tell your side of the story. Oh, no. The man who did this killed that poor girl. He's pure evil. Victor Creel. Penhurst Asylum. Yeah, as far as I know, he's still there. That is, unless he broke out. Like that, what's his name? The white mask. Kill the babysitters. Michael Myers. Um, I'll be right back. The dog's like, um, hello. Oh. The people that like that person's funeral. Отныне вы больше не люди. Вы бизнесы. Run, you die. You hear, America? I think she's talking to Enzo. Play it again. <laughs> Look at them little investigators, these two. Can you translate that? Uh, I can't understand it. It's too low. Who you are? She, she wants to use the phone. She's mad at that bitch. It's like pig here. Often directed at cops. Cops? Or guards. And does a prison guard. Maybe Hopper bribed him. You decided to be a douche to her all day? I wasn't being a douche. You were. You were. You were rolling your eyes. You were You were moping. You were barely talking. You basically sabotaged the whole well, day. Well, she was lying to you, Mike. Straight to your face ever since you got here. And, and I've been a total third wheel all day. It's been miserable. It seems like you made it super clear that you're not interested in anything I have to say. That's just not true. You've called maybe a couple times. It's been a year, Mike. Meanwhile, Elle has like a book of letters from you. That's because she's my girlfriend, Will. And us? We're friends. We're friends. <sighs> Super skinny. What did you do? What did you do? What have you done? Mm -hmm. Jesus. Like she didn't expect someone was gonna eventually beat her yeah. ass. Yeah, he's not there. Free for Rick! Shut up, Dustin. Go really high. My God. Is that a foot? No, that's what? just a shoe. Hey, guys. It's not a foot. No, it's just a shoe. What are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? You might be in here. <laughs> Someone was here. Maybe he heard us, got spooked and ran. Don't worry. Steve will get Just him with his oar. Uh, I know you think you're being funny, Henderson, but considering the fact that everyone in this room has nearly died about a hundred times personally, I don't find it funny in the- Wait, 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 wait. Steve, he's not gonna hurt you, right, Steve? Right. Yeah. Steve, why don't you drop the oar? Uh. Hey, cool, he's- Cool. <laughs> this is my friend Max, the one who never wants to play D and D. 
Okay. I don't blame him. I'd be like spooked as hell. You won't believe me. Trash. The car earlier, I, I can't find him. What do you mean you can't find I mean, him? He, he was there and then he was just gone. And uh, did you maybe see him leave with somebody? Or I told you kids to go home. Jesus Christ. This is Glenn. We might have a situation here. <laughs> Her bones started to snap. Her eyes, man, it was, it, it was like there was something like inside her head pulling. I left her there. You all think I'm crazy, right? No, we don't think you're crazy no, at don't all. Don't bullshit me, man. I know how this sounds. We're not bullshitting you. We believe you. You know how people say Hawkins is cursed? They're not way off. Sometimes it bleeds into ours. Like ghosts and shit? There are some things worse than ghosts. We needed to find you. If they're back again, we need to know. Friend. It would almost look like dust, swirling dust. No, man, there was nothing you could see or uh, or touch. I want you to join me. Uh -oh. Like she, she was in a trance or something. Oh, or under a spell. A curse. Vecna's curse. Who's Vecna? An undead creature of great power. Um, I wasn't as freaked out as that looking at this guy. Mm -hmm. um, and he does the same thing to everybody. Mm -hmm. It seems like so far. So once we saw and got shocked and ugh, by Chrissy. I mean, this was sad, though, this guy. It's because he got in an a that accident and like it's like all their worst memories. Yes. Like. He's trying to take that suffering away from him, but is he like a character in D and D or something? That's why they know him. The whole Stranger Things thing is basically D and D as a show. Oh, kinda. because the other one was uh, the other. Demogorgon was the one right. they had, and That's then they right. flipped the board over. Remember? That's right. That's right. Oh, that is so okay. That makes sense then. Okay. So, and I'm glad they found Eddie. Yeah. And, like, it was good that Nancy gave the uncle a chance to tell his side until she realized what's-his-face was gone. But, um, because the uncle knew he couldn't do this. Mm -hmm. I mean, I'm sorry. If I was Eddie, too, I'd have took off. I'd have scared the shit pants out of me. Yeah. You know? But it's good because now the friends that were sort of split apart, minus, um, Lucas. Mm hmm They're coming together for this. You know what I mean? It's because they all had the same experience. Yes. They know what they're doing. Yes. Um, but I wonder how the rest of them are going to sort of get sucked back into this. Well, we know Joyce and Murray are going to find Hopper. Yeah, she didn't even tell the kids she was leaving. She's just like, no, she's let's, like, let's okay, go. <laughs> Poor Hopper, though. Um, my God, man. I'm glad Angela got beat in the face with a roller skate. She deserved it. Well, how much can you take from, you know, her trying to... And, like, I'm sorry, but anybody that surrounds themselves with one singular bully mm -hmm. and just goes along with it and thinks it's funny is 
beyond the lowest of low human form. Like, come on. But nobody, like, the whole skater rink's laughing. Like, dude, it wasn't even that funny. It wasn't even that funny. You literally have no life if you think that's, like, the funniest thing you've ever seen. There's some some um, chocolate shake and it's like, oh, it's going to look like she shit herself. It really was on the front of her dress. Not on her back. Mm-hmm. You know? And, like, one person couldn't stand up for her. And I'm so pissed off at Will. He is just being, like... I mean, I get his side of story with Mike. That's his beef with Mike. No, that But don't take it out on her if that's what his issue is. Well, he didn't stand up for her at the school. Mm -hmm. He didn't stand up for her now. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. I feel like he's taking it out on her. Yeah. Because he's mad at Mike. Yeah. Yeah. And Mike is like, let's just find her, you know? And, um... But then it came when she did that, then it was giving her memories of when she was Papa, doing all that. But yeah. But I mean, how much can you take? Seriously. Like, y'all are really surprised she got beat up. And then know? she's there, like, yeah, I'm sure it hurt. It was the wheels of a roller skate. But like, don't be acting like you all like the victim now. You were the bully. Mm hmm. Don't be crying like that. Touch your face. Like, seriously. Like, ugh. I-, I can't stand anybody that bullies somebody else. And then that blonde guy, he's pissing me off, too. Whatever his name is. Oh, yeah, because now he's like, oh, we're going to go get Eddie because, like, he's whatever. And then Lucas can't even say, dudes, I play D&D. Who gives two flying craps? I mean, again, I've never played it, Mm -hmm. um, but I would never be like, well, well, you're just a a bad person because you play this game or whatever. Mm -hmm. Right? Nor would I say you're a geek because you play it. It's just what you play. Yeah. I just have never been around anybody that's played it, I guess, no. so I haven't, like, played it. But, like, Lucas couldn't even... He is so concerned about being cool. Or, like, trying to separate himself from being bullied. Yes. That he can't... He's like, oh, my sister. You know? No. I'm sorry. I mean, technically it wasn't alive, but technically it wasn't the whole truth in there. No. It's, I'm sorry. That blonde guy, I mean, come on. He couldn't, like, do anything to a fly. Come on. He's all, Also, like, what human bends the fingers like that? Yeah, exactly. Like, that did not look like somebody bending somebody else's well, fingers. Well, he didn't see what she looked like, though. No, I'm saying, like, that he were saying yeah. about him, that did not look like somebody could possibly... No. ...bend the fingers like that. No. And, oh, like, she's not into... Well, I understand if you if she hadn't been before, but... Because that weird shit was happening to her, she's like, um, she couldn't take it, right? Mm-hmm. Like, sometimes you just don't know what people are doing or hiding from you. You don't. So, he, now that guy, he's going to get what's coming for him. Come on. Like, he, he really, like, he's just all like, oh, talk. The dude, the dude's not going to do anything. No. If anything, it'd be the, the guys around him that might, like, try to, but come on. Eddie is, like, freaking six foot, and this guy's, like, he looks like he's like five or six or something. Not that Eddie would purposely fight somebody, but like I think uh, Eddie could beat him up. Mm-hmm. Plus now he has the group behind him, so. <laughs> Steve was poking at it. Hello. So aggressively. <sighs> and then he's like, he was like, just lift the tarp. And he's like, if you want it, you lift the tarp if you're so brave or whatever, however he said it. I, I don't blame him for like coming at Steve with that because he's traumatized. Mm hmm. He is freaking traumatized. Um, wow. That was good. Yeah. So how many? Oh, well. We we, have five more left that's on Netflix so far. No, but I think July some. The last two come out on July 1st. Oh, it's just two two after that? And then. Well, they're supposed to be longer, I think. Oh, okay. Um. So. Yeah. Good episode. Two thumbs up. Anything else we're going to end this? Nope. I'm glad we got to see Hopper, though. Yep. I just... How's Joyce going to get $40,000? She, she said it was in Hopper's trust for Elle. Oh, and she had access to it. That's what the I guy said. I didn't hear that part. Oh, on the phone? The Russian guy? So, obviously, yeah, he's telling this guy stuff, right? Mm-hmm. Um, and Murray. Murray's just along for a mystery. He likes a good theory. A good investigation. I like Murray. Yeah, he's funny. He is funny. Nope. Nope. All right. Well, uh, do you, let's do our YouTube stuff as usual. If you haven't subscribed, don't know what you're waiting for, 
Come on. Like I said last time, get on the conga line. Yeah, and we're almost to... Let's conga. We're closer to the 1,000. Yep, that's our goal. Um, a lot of people, and I, I said it in the Midnight Mass one, but if you didn't watch that one, a lot of people make large... They're probably like, oh, when we get to 10,000, we get to this. Well, why make such great goals? I mean, such large goals. You know, we had like our 500, and then we were like 800, and then the 1,000, and just... Take it step by step, but hey, let's come on, get on the conga line, man. Come on, subscribe. Let's help help these right, gals. Yeah, over eight hundred person conga line. Yeah, help these gals get to a thousand. Um, and you know, hit the bell, and you know, share and, and all that good stuff. Um, and all the other links to our social media are in our, the description. <laughs> With that, this mama Sita, it's late, going to sleep. So I bid you good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are in your part of the world. As always, be be kind. Till we meet again. Toodles.